Yo, what's going on guys? It's Frank the Prankster. And in today's video, we are going to be doing another crazy prank. Let's get it. Hey, uh, uh, Leah, I actually have this extra can of soda. Did you want it by chance? Uh, sure. Thanks, Frank. It's my pleasure. He's super nice, I guess. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> Aaliyah, look what the mess you just made. But it wasn't my fault, Principal Steven. Frank gave me the can. Uh, Principal Steven, I was just being nice by giving her my soda. It's not my fault that she spilled it. He's right. You can't blame him when you're just doing a good deed. Now clean this up right away. But I- I don't want to hear any more excuses. Okay, sorry. We got her so good. Okay, check me out. If this video hits, let's say, 10,000 views, then the next prank will be even bigger. Let's get it. <laughs> Bruh, you know that TikTok you posted yesterday? Really? Yeah, man, it already has like 25,000 views. I mean, that's cool, but like, what if you get in trouble? I mean, what if the principal finds out? He won't, all right? If, even if he does, I mean, it's not gonna matter for long because as soon as I start getting a million views a video, I'm dropping out of this place, becoming a full-time TikToker, man. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna be that easy. Uh, yes, it will, all right? All I gotta do is upload more and more bangers, bro, like the one I'm about to do right now. Learn from the best. Yo, what's going on, Frankster Nation? We are back with another crazy prank. This is gonna be epic. Let's get it. Yo, hold this, hold this, hold this. Give me your book, give me your book. Got it? Shoot, I dropped my book. Can you please grab it for me? I hurt my back the other day. Sure. Ah, oh, thanks. Thanks so much. Appreciate it. Oh, by the way, um, I think someone left something in, in your locker for you. What is it? <laughs> we got her. Kenza! What in the world is all of this? I'm so sorry. Someone put a glitter bomb in my locker. I've seen these before. Are you trying to play pranks at school? No, not at all. I, I have no idea who put this in my <laughs> locker. Mm-hmm. Clean all of this up. I don't want to have to give you detention. Yo, Frank Donation! I can't believe that that works. Yo, yeah. Make sure to leave a like down below if you enjoyed this video. And let's see if we can hit 50,000 views and I'll do an even bigger one. Let's get it. Yo, I already know this is gonna blow up, bro. I don't know, man. I, I mean, like, how would you feel if someone did that to you? <sighs> Just relax, man, all right? I got this. Come on, let's get out of here. Did he get you too? Are you talking about Frank? Yep. I knew it was him. What should we do? I don't know. But I'll think of something. Hey, where's your project at? Oh, who cares? I'm gonna be TikTok famous, bro. Yo, it, check out this video from yesterday. It already has over 100,000 views. <sighs> you know, maybe you should just quit while you're ahead. <laughs> yeah, right, dude. I, this next video is gonna blow up even more. Check me out, man. Yo, what's going on, Frank's the Nation? It's your homie, and you already know what time it is. We're back with the Nether prank. Let's get it. There. Someone could slip and fall. <laughs> That's exactly the point. You just wait for it. No, man. No, it's not cool. <laughs> oh no, my project. Are you alright? What happened? I slipped on this banana peel. Who in the world? Hey, yo, would... Frank's the nation. We got him. Yo, I'll tell you guys what. If this video breaks 500,000 views by tomorrow, then I will do my biggest prank ever. Let's get it. I know it was you who put the banana peel over there. I can't believe you did that. You completely ruined Brandon's project. Oh, come on, guys. It was just a prank. It's not just a prank. You could have seriously hurt him. 
You should know that your actions always find a way of coming back to you. I agree. <laughs> Seriously, Mark? You too? Okay, yeah, come on. You guys are just little- Good morning, class. I'm sorry I'm late. Who made that big mess? Frank put a banana peel on the floor so I would trip and it completely ruined my project. Frank, is that true? Uh, no, no, Miss J, it was an accident. I was throwing away my banana peel in the trash. And I guess I must have missed, I'm so sorry. <sighs> yeah, right, you did it on purpose. If you look at his TikTok- Brandon, it's not nice to accuse people. He said it was an accident. Besides, we should all be more careful to watch where we're going. Now, come on, and just clean it up. But Brandon's telling the truth. That's enough. It's nobody's fault. Come on, Brandon. It's not gonna clean itself up. I'll help you. So will I. How can we make Frank pay for all of this? Someone's gotta teach him a lesson. Hmm. What if we put a thumbtack on his seat? Yeah. But that could actually hurt him. It's not like he cared about me falling. How about if we shaved his head? I like that. But it can take him months to grow it back. Why are you sticking up for him? After everything he's done to us? Uh, didn't we tell Frank that his actions will always find a way to come back to him? Yeah. But that's what we're doing. We're making his actions come back to him. True, but that also means our actions will come back to us. Oh, wow. I. Never thought about it like that. So, you're saying we just don't do anything? It'll catch up to him. We just have to wait. Look, there he is! I bet he's about to pull another prank. Let's see what he's doing. Yo, what's going on, Frank's Nation? We are back with another prank, guys. I can't believe that that last video went viral. You guys are crazy, but we are back. Check this out, look. Yo, this prank is gonna be lit. Let's get it. He's setting up the milk and feathers to land on whoever walks through that door. You gotta stop him. I have an idea. Can one of you record him, please? Yeah, sure. What's your plan? To expose him. Just watch. Yo, Frankster Nation. Yo, okay, we are back and look, 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 look at the setup. Yeah, yo, this is gonna be crazy. I'm telling you guys right now, this is going to be epic. And all I ask is for this video to hit 1 million views and I'm coming with more and more banger. Okay, guys, I hear, I hear footsteps. <laughs> okay, yes, dude. When she comes out the door, she's gonna duck. Let's see. Wait, wait what? No. <sighs> Steven? Uh, uh, Frank, what in the world? I, 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 I can explain. Um, no, 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 no need further. Oh. oh my gosh. He's in so much trouble. Frank! Principal Steven, I, I am so sorry. I'm so sorry. It, it's not what it looks like. It was an accident. You expect me to believe that that was an accident? Yes, yes, it was an accident. I, I am so sorry. You are in big trouble in my office right now. Did he get it? Yeah. Wait, were you the one who told the principal to? Yep. <laughs> we got it back good. <laughs> Let's see the video. You are <laughs> <laughs> So, how long do you have to do this for? <sighs> like a month. Dang, that sucks, but I tried telling you that. I know, I know. Your actions always have a way of coming back to you. Hey, Frank. <laughs> We've been looking for your TikTok account, but we can't find it. Yeah, well, that's because my mom made me delete it, so. Oh, that sucks, but at least you got what you wanted. What, what, what are you talking about? A video that broke a million views. I check it out. Welcome, people! 
there's something in, in your locker for you. If you even believe that somebody might get hurt, <laughs> then no, don't do it. Don't do that, Frank. But if it's fun, ah! go for it. Have a good time. I'm getting milk poured on me today. What's going on? Milk your feathers. How are you, bro? Got me. No. Okay. Can anyone tell me what kind of an angle this is? How about Mikey? Mikey! Uh, what's up? Mm-hmm. Listening to music in my class, eh? Give them to me. Sorry. Can you tell me what kind of angle number one is? Mm, a triangle. That is incorrect. You did do last night's reading assignment, right? It, yeah, I just didn't remember that one, that's all. Good, because I have a little surprise for everyone. Pop quiz, woohoo! All right, everybody take your stuff off your desk except for your pencils. And don't turn the paper over until I ask you to. Oh, this sucks. You should have that reading, like I told you to. Just turn your quiz towards me, okay? And I'll copy the answers. No. That will be cheating. Bye. So I decided to make this. I'll figure something else out then. Ow! Are you alright? No, my stomach, it really hurts. Did you eat something bad? Maybe. I'm allergic to peanuts. They might have been in something I ate. Oh! Oh, in that case, you better go to the nurse's office. But I don't want to miss your quiz. It's okay. Your health is way more important. Thanks, Mr. Matthews. Uh, I'm really sorry. It's not your fault. Just feel better. <laughs> Hopefully we get to play basketball today. You know you run on Wednesdays. I don't want to run. It's so hot. There's no way of getting out of this. Mr. Wiley's coming. All right, everyone. We're doing one mile today. What? Are you crazy? That's way too far. We could do two miles. Let's go. Follow my lead. I don't want to run. My lead's good for you. It's not like you have a choice. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, hey, your shoelace. Oh, thanks. Actually, I've got an idea. What are you talking about? Oh, just watch. Oh, 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 my ankle. Mikey. Mikey, are you okay? My ankle, I think I twisted it. Shoelace is untied. It's probably how you fell. Can you put any pressure on it? I don't know. Let me try. Ugh. Barely. You think you can make it to the nurse's office? I don't know, but you guys go on without me. Uh, are you sure? I can call for help. Actually, isn't your mom a nurse? What's her number? I'll try calling her right now. Uh, no, don't do that. Um, I mean, I can't run, but I'll make it to the nurse's office. Okay, great. Make sure to tie your shoelace, all right? Hope you feel better, Mikey. All right, guys, keep running. Come on. Oh, I heard you've been showing Darman videos in class. My son really loves those. Yeah, yeah. The kids seem to learn a lot from them. Oh. No. Most do, at least. That one, he's a constant troublemaker. Mikey? He twisted his ankle on our run today. Poor fella. <coughs> Looks like he's feeling better, though. Mm-hmm. Hey. He told me he had a stomach ache this morning, so he couldn't take the pop quiz. Hmm. Wait. Did he happen to twist his ankle at the beginning of the run, or at the end? At the beginning, why? Oh, are you saying he... I, I don't know for sure, but for someone with a stomach ache and a twisted ankle, he seems to be doing just fine now. Wow. I'm gonna have a little talk with him and... Oh, oh, oh. I got a better idea. Hey, Jaden, do me a favor. I'm not gonna let you call me my answers again. I know that, genius. You think I don't have a better plan? Let me see that bar. Why? Because I'm hungry. 
Yeah, like, you know, when you keep playing, people stop believing after a while. Hey, everybody, sorry I'm late. I just printed off your exams. Booyah! Mikey, is everything all right? <laughs> hey, are you okay? No, oh, feels like I can't breathe. Did you eat this bar? Well, this has peanuts in it. No wonder I'm having an allergic reaction. Shoot, we, we better get you to the nurse right away. But I can't afford to miss your quiz. It's all right, health always comes first. Come on, I'll take you. Uh, no, I'm fine. I'll go by myself. Don't worry about me. No, I insist. Jaden, would you mind handing this out to everyone? No problem. Thanks. Come on, let's go. Hang in there, buddy. Honestly, I'm feeling a little better. <laughs> you can go, Mr. Matthews. <clears throat> Mikey, back again, I see. He's having trouble breathing. Huh. It might be an allergic reaction. Well, it looks like we're going to have to call your mother. My mom? Oh, yes. No, please don't call her. Well, you are having trouble breathing, right? Yes. Mm. Well, then that settles it. Uh, let's see here. Hello? Yes, Mrs. Miller. I, I have your son Mikey in my office. It seems he's having trouble breathing. He seems to be stable for now. And since you work at the hospital, I thought I'd give you a call first. Thank you. Well, if he can't breathe, I don't want to waste any time. Call an ambulance right away. Oh, oh yes, of course. Yeah. Uh, an ambulance? <laughs> oh. Hey, hey, Mom, it's me. Um, I'll be fine, I promise. We can't take any chances, Mikey. But I don't want to go in an ambulance because I'm... Uh, because I'm scared of him. Hey, it's Mr. Matthews. You know what? I'll just bring him. Are you sure? <sighs> Thank you so much. See you soon. Come on, Mikey. We gotta go right away. Okay. <laughs> oh, so good we were able to get you a room so quickly. <sighs> the doctor should be here any second. Mom, I don't need a doctor, really. I'm going to be fine. Can we please just go home? Sweetheart, this is nothing to take lightly. Is he doing okay? No. He's having trouble breathing. He ate some peanuts and he's allergic to them. Oh, no. We should get ready to operate right away then. Operate? No. There's no need for any of that. He may be in anaphylactic shock. It creates difficulty in breathing and, in some extreme cases, can even lead to death. Death? No. No, I can't lose my Mikey. No, I'm fine. Really? See? I can breathe normally. The last time I heard a patient say that, a few moments later, she slipped into cardiac arrest. What? No. Hang in there, Mikey. You gotta hang on. I'm calling the code red. <coughs> oh, what's that noise? Turn that off, please. What's going on, Doc? We've got a level five anaphylactic shock. That's not good. I made the call. Cut the operation. Mikey, are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. Please, I just want to go home. Nurse sedative. Now. It's gonna be okay. Wait, what there. is it? It's gonna be okay. Thank you. Okay, Mikey, I'm gonna give you a heavy dose in three. Stop! I made it all up, okay? What are you talking about? I faked having an allergic reaction. So I didn't have to do our test. What do you mean for it to go this far? Mikey, are you saying that you and lied? I lied, okay? I'm sorry. Well, it's too late. What are you doing? We still have to give you a shot. No, 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 no! It's just fake <laughs> retractable <laughs> syringe. <laughs> it's not real. None of it is. Not even the siren. That's not even hooked up to anything. We knew you were faking it all along. You did? I'll see you later, Kathy. Bye. Bye. Thanks for all your help. But... 
How did you know that I was lying? Well, when you keep lying, people will stop believing you after a while. And you don't have a very good track record, do you? I guess I don't. Sorry. Well, don't think you're getting out of it that easy. You are in big trouble. But we'll deal with that when you get home. Right now, you have an exam to take. Come on, Mikey. Let's go to school. Hey, Mikey. How's that ankle feeling? To tell you the truth, my ankle never even really hurt. I just didn't want to run. I must say, I respect your honesty. Well, since your ankle doesn't hurt, while everyone else plays basketball, you can run. No! I don't want to run a mile. Who said anything about a mile? We'll go for two. See you in class. Oh, and good luck on Mr. Matthews' exam. like working at Darman Studio. <laughs> I love it. They are lovely boys. So much energy, so much creativity, so much imagination, and never a dull moment. Hell yeah! Ah, oh, thank you again for watching my little girls. You are a lifesaver. Oh, it's my pleasure, Mr. Erickson. Plus, Carla is such a sweetheart. And Brittany... <laughs> is a typical teenage girl? Exactly. Mm -hmm. I get it. All right, well, I better get going. Okay. Oh, just a reminder, I won't be here tomorrow because I'm going to the Adele concert. Yeah, the agency let me know already. Hopefully they'll be able to find me someone else. You know, you have fun. <laughs> Thanks, see you. Okay. <laughs> Hey, Pumpkin, I missed you too. Oh. Now, Daddy's gonna make a phone call and I will be right back. Hey, watch it. Oops, sorry, I forgot you existed. Not funny. Dad! Just the guy I'm looking for. Here's the new skirt and jacket I wanted. Can I have your credit card? You know, a hi, Dad, how was your day? Would be nice, Brittany. Hi, Dad, how was your day? Busy as usual. Tomorrow's gonna be even busier. I need to find a new sitter for you girls. That's good. Now back to the skirt and jacket. How much is it? $180. Oh, that's just the skirt, the jacket's extra. Brittany, we've already talked about this. If you're gonna be a shopaholic. Fashionista. Whatever you call it, you're gonna have to pay for it yourself. These clothes are not cheap. How do you expect me to pay for that? Uh, same way everyone else does, by getting a job. Why would I do that? That's what you're here for. It's not happening. Ugh. dress up and have a tea party? I'd rather eat your crayons. Hello, Mr. Erickson. How may I help you? Yeah, I was wondering if you'd find me a sitter for tomorrow night. I know it's short notice. Let me see what we can do. It doesn't look like anyone's available. Saturday's our most popular day. Ah, I understand. All right, I'll figure something out. Also, the $2,000 payment for February is due soon. $2,000? Dad, hang up. See you call oh, back. OK, uh, actually, I'll call back, but thank you. No problem. Have a nice day. You pay $2,000 for a babysitter? Yeah, it's for the whole month. Why? Uh, hello. Give it to me. I'll babysit Carla. <laughs> You're not responsible enough to babysit your sister. You can't even do your chores. Look at this sink full of dirty dishes. I can be responsible. Please, Dad. I'll, I'll even wash the dishes right now. I just don't think it's a good idea. How about this? 
I'll try it tomorrow, and when I prove it to you that I can do it, then you'll hire me and cancel the babysitter. What other option do you have? Doesn't seem like anyone else can do it. How do you feel, honey? Do you want Brittany to be your babysitter? I'll play dress up and have a tea party with you. Really? Okay. Great, that settles it. If we do this, you have to understand, it's important to take your responsibilities seriously. Of course, I know that. So when do I get the $2,000? <laughs> I'm only agreeing to try this for a day. If all goes well and you commit to a month, then you'll get paid. <laughs> Thanks, Dad! You won't regret this. I hope not. Wait, wait, where are you going? To figure out all the stuff I can buy with that money. But you said you'd wash the dishes. <sighs> you know, I think the milk's gone bad, so... Don't use it. And make sure that the windows are closed and latched tight. And if the smoke detector goes off, don't just take out the batteries. You have to, are you even listening? Can you just relax? You're acting like I'm gonna start a fire. Now that you mention it, if there is a fire, I keep an extinguisher in the laundry room. Dad? I know all this stuff. I live here too, remember? Brittany, this is important. I'm putting my trust in you. We'll be fine. Carla's easy to take care of. And we're gonna have so much fun together. Can we play Barbies and hopscotch? Uh, we can talk about that after Dad leaves. Last thing, and this is the most important. Make sure not to let Carla out of your sight. I saw on Facebook the other day there's been some suspicious man in the area. A suspicious man? In this neighborhood? Yeah. He was last seen wearing a fake Amazon delivery uniform, so no opening the door for anyone. You're just trying to scare me. I am serious. So please, keep your sister by your side at all times. Can you do that for me? I've got this, Dad. <sighs> Go! Call me if you have any problems. Okay, okay, uh, going. So, do you want to play Barbies first or hopscotch? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm like super busy right now. But I thought we were going to play. Listen, Carla, here's the deal. I'm going to chill over here, and you can go and do whatever you want. So just leave me alone, okay? But that's not fun. You said you were going to play with me. Let's go hopscotch, please. No, I already told you I'm busy. Besides, you can go do that by yourself. I can't go outside alone. You heard what Dad said. That made up story about a delivery man. Come on, he was just saying that to scare us. What if it's real? Relax. I think I know when dad is trying to teach me a lesson. Besides, I grew up playing outside this house. Nothing's gonna happen. You promise I'll be okay? I promise. All right. Just stay on our driveway. This is cute. Kidnap her! Kidnap her! What are you talking about? There's a man coming to the front door! Relax. It's just the food delivery guy. Did you order food? No, did you? I don't even have a phone. Okay, then they just got the wrong address. I'll just tell him. Wait! What if he's the guy Dad's talking about? I already told you. 
Dad was just trying to scare us. Grub hub for Sam? Sorry, there's no Sam here. Are you sure? Positive. It's just me and my sister. Oh, parents aren't home? Uh, I think Sam's food is getting cold. You should go find the right address. See? Wrong address. You told him we were home alone. No, I didn't. You might as well have. Can you just chill? Nothing bad happened. We're fine. Well, I'm definitely not going back outside alone. That's fine. Just go play with your Barbies. Hey, girl. What are you doing right now? Nothing important. Just watching my baby sister. Oh. Never mind then. I was going to invite you to the sale at the plaza. There's a sale? I want to go. What about your sister? She'll be fine at home. I do not want to miss this. <laughs> but dang, I'm broke. At least until my dad pays me tonight for babysitting. If you need to borrow some money again, I don't mind. As long as you pay me back this time. Really? <gasps> You're the best! <laughs> okay, I'll head out now. Meet you in 30? Sounds good. See you soon. You're gonna leave me? I'm just going to the store real quick. I'll be right back. What if that guy comes back? Just stay inside the house, you'll be fine. I'm gonna call Dad. No, don't do that. He'll kill me if he finds out. I'm not staying at the house by myself. Fine, you're coming with me. Just don't say anything. But I don't wanna go shopping. I'll buy you ice cream or something, okay? Really? Okay. Just wash your face. Ah. It's blue. Mm. I'm bored. You're just in time. I couldn't miss it. <laughs> she ran two red lights. Hey, you little snitch. I didn't realize you were coming. Are you going to buy some Balenciaga too? No, I'm only here so I don't get taken away. Taken away? My dad put this idea in her head that some scary man is going to come and kidnap her. It's crazy how many scary things have been happening lately. Did you hear about that guy who dressed up as a fake Amazon delivery man? You heard that story? Yeah, it's scary. I told you. Oh, come on. I'm sure it's... You all right? Yeah, I, I think I'm seeing things. Anyway, I cannot believe the sale today. I know, right? This is like a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Ah, it's going to be so much fun. I'm so excited. I really want that jacket that I told you about. The, the jacket? I, yes. What do you want? How long is this going to take? I don't know. Why? What do you need? Someone just took the dress I was going to buy. I really need to go to the bathroom. Why didn't you go before we came? I didn't need to go before. Someone just took another dress. Thanks a lot, Carla. Excuse me, do you have a bathroom here? There's one at the end of the plaza. Okay, you can go. Just come back soon. You're not gonna take me? And lose out on more items? Yeah, right. It's not that far. You'll be fine by yourself. Girl, we hit the jackpot. I am so mad you got the last jacket. I really wanted it. You snooze, you lose. But since you covered me, I'll maybe let you borrow it. How kind of you. So when do you think you'll be able to pay me back? As soon as I get paid tonight for babysitting car. Wait, where's Carla? I don't know, I thought she was with you. Shoot, uh, she said she was going to the bathroom and I don't think she ever came back. Please tell me this isn't happening. Can you call her? She doesn't have a cell phone. She has to be around here somewhere. Maybe you should call your dad. And let him know I lost Carla? No way. Okay. Okay, oh, thank you. 
Excuse me. Are you looking for that little girl that was in line with you? Yeah, that was my little sister. Have you seen her? Yes. A man was with her. A man? What? What did he look like? Oh, I'm sorry, dear. I only saw the back of his head. I thought maybe it was her father. No, no, my, my dad's at work. Uh... Should we call the police? No! Uh, thank you. I'll handle it from here. I appreciate your help. No, this cannot be happening. I hope it wasn't him. Who? There was this guy at our door today. Um, he looked kind of sketchy. And then earlier when we were lying, I thought I saw him again over there. He followed you here? Maybe. I, I don't know. Oh no, it's Dad. Answer it. Maybe he found Carla. Okay. Um... Hey, Dad. Uh, how's work? That's good. Busy's good. Uh, Carla? Yeah, um, she's just, she's just taking a nap right now, but I'll let her know you called. Yeah, um, I have to keep my eye on the stove, so I, I gotta go. I love you, Dad. Bye. Okay, so good news is my dad doesn't know, um, so we just have to find her before he comes home from work. What are you gonna do? Uh, let's not jump to conclusions. Maybe it's not creepy Grubhub guy. No. No, 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 no way, this cannot be real. What? What? If you ever want to see your sister again, you're going to have to pay no cops. Oh my goodness. This is officially a nightmare. We have to call the police or tell your dad? He can't find out. I'm supposed to prove that I'm responsible. What is he going to think if I lose my little sister? I think you have a much bigger problem. I know, Amber! He what your dad's going to think. I have to fix this. Okay, uh... He wants money, so, uh... Let's see what he's asking for. You're texting back a kidnapper? That's not smart. $2,500. I don't like this. You shouldn't be responding back to him. Do you think it'd be crazy if I borrowed that much money from you? Bernie, you're actually gonna pay him? It's my sister. Look, I'll return the clothes and my dad will give me 2K. Um, I'll figure the rest out and I promise I'll pay you back. This is not safe. We need to tell somebody. You don't understand. If my dad finds out, he'll never trust me again. And besides, who knows what the kidnapper is going to do if we involve the police? Please? Can you trust me? Fine. But if we're actually going to do this, then I need to stop by a bank. Thank you so much. Um... Do you think we should have put the money in something else? Shh. I don't want anyone knowing what we're carrying. Two girls lost? No, we're just meeting someone. Hi. Right. Careful. A lot of sketchy people around here. You! Where's my little sister? Relax. She's fine. Bring the cash. Wait, but how do we know she's safe? I promise you she is. I'm not here to hurt her. Hey, you got your cash. Now, where's my sister? I'll bring her in a minute. First, give me your phones. Why? So you don't call the cops after I leave? I'm not dumb. Come on. Thank you. All right, I'll bring her. Hey! Hey, stop! Get back here! Gray, he's gone. Okay, we need to tell your dad and the cops right now. With what phones? I have a tablet in my car, we can use that. Let's go. Wait, maybe we should tell my dad first. Okay, what's his number? <sighs> He's gonna kill me. We don't have time for this. Unless you know some other way to find your sister, we need to tell him. Hold on, do you find my iPhone turned on? You wanna keep chasing after him? 
Brittany, this whole thing has gone on way too far. We are in way over our heads. This is way too dangerous. The cops are gonna need to know regardless. So please tell me where he went. He has our phones. Fine. There he is. Wait, is that? Oh my God. Let's go. She's not in her room. She's not here either. I don't think she can help. This is all my fault. If I just took my responsibilities more seriously, then this whole thing would have never happened. Hey, hey, what's all this Dad, yelling about? You're here. Yeah, I got off early. And to my surprise, no one was here. Where'd you go? You went shopping? <sighs> Was that before or after I called to ask how everything was going? During. I lied. Carla wasn't napping. Now why on earth would you lie about that, Brittany? Because... Because I lost Carla. You what? I know, I'm sorry. We have to call the police, Dad. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Can we tell her now? Carla, you're okay. Oh my gosh, I was so worried about you. But how did you get here? We were pretending the whole time. We? I, I'm so confused. You had something to do with this? I did. Wait, I, I, I don't understand. What about the kidnapper? I guess that's my cue. You again? Mr. Erickson, call the cops. That won't be necessary. This is one of my employees, Dave. Sorry I gave you girls a scare. Got all your stuff right here. Can you please just tell me what's going on? When I left the house earlier, I realized I forgot my wallet. When I came back, what did I see? Carla playing by herself outside. Exactly what I told you not to let her do. Sorry. So your dad asked me to come by and pretend to be a Grubhub delivery guy. <laughs> we even told Carla about the plan. Yep, I knew the whole time. I was supposed to end right there, but just to be safe, I had Dave stick around. And sure enough, a little while later, I saw you girls leaving. I asked him to follow to see what you would do and to make sure you were safe. And what did he see? Me letting Carla leave the store by herself. Exactly. That's when Dave had Carla go with him. And the only reason I called you- Was to test me. Mm -hmm. And you failed, big time. And to put the cherry on top, I had Dave drop off Carla with me while you ran around chasing him. I can't believe you took it that far. I was seriously freaked out. Oh, don't try to turn this around on me. None of this would have happened if you- I know. If I would have taken my responsibilities more seriously. Which clearly you didn't. So you can kiss this babysitter job goodbye. But I spent $500 today. Can you please at least give me just that for working today? You seriously have the nerve to ask me that? After what you did? You're in big trouble, young lady. Do you mind if I get the stuff from the car so I can return it and pay you back? Return it? Are you kidding? You got some really nice stuff. I'm keeping it for myself. Wow, way to kick me when I'm down. I should probably get going, boss. Thanks again for your help, Dave. I gotta go too. I'm glad everything worked out. See you in class. There's just one thing I still don't get. How come everybody knew about the Amazon delivery guy? Oh, that story was true. It really was all over the news. But what I didn't mention is that they caught the guy a few weeks ago. Well, that's good because I never want to go through anything like this ever again. You know, in a weird way, I didn't realize how much I loved you until you were gone. I love you too. <laughs> I have an idea. How about a tea party? Seriously? Okay, I'll get everything ready. <laughs> okay, just give me a moment. I have to do one thing first.
That's definitely a good start, but you're not getting off that easy. Can we talk about it after dinner? I'm starving. Sure, I'll order us something. Grubhub? No! No, uh, let's do Postmates or Uber Eats. I'm traumatized now. <laughs> okay. Hi, Jasmine. Hi, Eve. What did I say about knocking before you come in? Oh, yeah, she just Sorry. irritates me so much. I just think she lives up to you and wants to be like you. Rosa! You used my new palette? Why do you have to ruin everything? You know, sometimes I wish I didn't even have a little sister. This is Kristen, your new babysitter. Make sure you listen to her. Hi. You better be on your best behavior, young man. He's got a bad track record. You're now his third sitter. The other two quit. Are you listening? If this doesn't work out with Kristen, we're just gonna have to send you to boarding school. What? No way. I'm not going there. Well, you better be good then. Please, don't hesitate to call us for anything. Don't worry. I do have a pretty special way with kids. <laughs> I'm sure we'll be able to find some way to get him to listen. Mm -hmm. Well, if you do, you'll have to teach me. And me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, here is $40 to order some food for the two of you. Well, thank you. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Oh, a few house rules. No shoes, no alcohol. And please, no having any friends over. Of course not. I totally understand. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay, see you, Elijah. We'll be back around 10. Bye. Bye. doing? You're not supposed to have your shoes on in the house. Is that alcohol? You can't be drinking. Quiet, twerp. Now this is how it's gonna go. You're gonna do what I say and we're not gonna have any problems. Got it? I don't know who you think you're talking to. Now what? you listen to me. You heard what your dad said. Unless you want to get shipped off to boarding school, you be quiet. Now sit down. Yes, they're back, I'm telling on you. Wait, no, give me one. Oh. Who are you? Uh, is Kristen here? Hey, babe. Hey, it's you. Come on in. You can't have anyone here. My mom said no friends allowed. Oh, well, Chris isn't my friend, he's my boyfriend. Get lost. But I said scram! Should I take off my shoes? No. Oh, this kid's parents have only been gone three minutes. He's already driving me crazy. That sucks. Here you go. With an extra pump, just how you like it. Oh, oh thank you. Oh. I have no idea how badly I needed this. Mm. Wait, I have an idea. Uh. Even better. <laughs> nice. Mm. Anyways, I just came here to bring you that. I gotta get going. Love you. Wait. You wouldn't happen to have, you know, anything a little bit harder than alcohol. Mm, not with me. But I do know where we can get some. Perfect. I need something to hold me over while I watch this brat. Let's go. Where are you going? You can't just leave me here by myself. And why not? If something happens to me, you know how much trouble you'll be in? Ugh, fine. Do you have a cell phone? No. Give me your tablet. Why? I said give it to me or you're not coming with us. Okay, here. What do you need it for anyway? So you can't record anything. 
parents told me how sneaky you are. Now, come on. I said come on! Okay. I don't see him. Where is he? He should be here any second. Can we get some food? I'm hungry. Shh. I don't want to hear any more complaining. <sighs> there he is. Who are we even meeting? Can you have him come to your side of the car? I don't want to talk to him. Why not? You already know I have a criminal record. I can't take any chances. Okay, so you're fine with me getting in trouble? Please. Hey, you looking for something? Yeah. Um, yeah. Whatever this will get us. Hey! That's the money my mom gave you to buy food for us! You keep quiet! Hey, what's with the kid? He's just someone I'm babysitting. Ignore him. <laughs> and you decided to bring him here? A savage. There you go. Thank you. Did you just do what I think you just did? You better not say anything. <laughs> Are you kidding? When my parents get home, I'm seeing it like a thunder. And they're not gonna believe you. Unless you wanna spend the rest of your childhood in boarding school, you'll keep your mouth shut. <sighs> Thank you, babe. We can go now. Of course. You make me something to eat. I'm starving. Make it yourself. I don't know how. Can I at least get my tablet back then? No, no, leave me alone. I'm watching a movie. <sighs> yes, mom and dad. Just wait until I tell them about. Who are you? Wait, is, is this for? Oh, you ordered pizza? I'll take that. <laughs> no, I'm not here to deliver. <sighs> hey, babe. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I missed you. Oh, I've missed you too. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm, I'm Dave, Kristen's boyfriend. Look, if you want some pizza, I can. Just no, that's not for him. That's for us. <laughs> what? I thought the other guy was your boyfriend. For you. <sighs> They're both my boyfriends. Chris gets me Starbucks. Dave gets me food. I get the best of both worlds. And they're okay with that? <laughs> yeah, right. No, if either one of them found out about each other, they would both dump me. Which is why you need to keep quiet. Huh? At least let me get a slice of pizza. I want my tablet back. I mean, tablet back. Come on. No. Oh, sucks. And here we are, folks. We have a pasta oh, so for the missus <laughs> and a steak and potatoes for the gentleman. Thank you. Enjoy. Oh, no. It's the babysitter. I hope everything's okay. I'm just gonna take it. Hello? Mom? Elijah? Yes, Mom, no, it's me. You won't believe this. The babysitter, she's crazy. Oh. She's walking around with her shoes on. She has two different boyfriends. And she even used the money you gave her to buy drugs. Elijah. I'm not falling for any more of your tricks. Let me talk to him. Listen to me, son. You better behave because we're not playing around anymore. No, Dad, let me swing. Don't hang up. Hello? That's your son. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh, I can't believe this. Hello? <sighs> well, you should probably get going, babe. His parents are gonna be back any minute now. Mm. Go away, Elijah! Okay, but I just wanted to let you know that there's someone here to see you. Yep, right! I know what you're doing! You. What are you, what are you doing here? <laughs> what do you mean? Elijah said you wanted to see me? Babe? Who is that? Uh, no one. Just give me one second. <laughs> Did some guy just call you babe? What? Who's in there? 
Uh, I was watching TV. I don't. Uh, no. Why are you close the door? Uh, Who are you? Who am I? I'm her boyfriend. Who are you? Boyfriend? Everyone, just calm down because I can, I can explain all of this. Mm. It's hot in here. It's hot. <laughs> There's nothing to explain. You're both her boyfriends. Oh, that's not true. Don't a joke. touch me, it's not a joke. She said she uses you for Starbucks and you to bring her food. Oof. <laughs> so you're not only cheating on me, but you're also using me. Uh, I thought you said you loved me. Uh, I'm out of here. Have a good life, Kristen. Uh, right behind you, brother. This relationship is over. Can we, can we like talk about this, you guys? You guys! Ugh. You! Did you use my phone to call Chris and tell him to come over? I might have. Oh, you just wait until your parents come home. In fact, no, I'm calling them right now. Okay. Hope you're gonna tell them you had guys over. And that you bought jokes with their money. <laughs> like they would believe anything you had to say. They already know you're a little liar. I'll just tell them you made the whole thing up and they'll ship you off to boarding school where you belong. <laughs> okay. Sounds like they're already here. You're doomed. Okay. <laughs> 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 Mr. and Mrs. Milner, ah, I'm glad you're back. Hey, Kristen, how was everything? I hope he wasn't too bad. <laughs> right. Uh, I wanted to call you several times this evening, but I didn't want to ruin your night out, so... Elijah, he, he... Oh my gosh, what's wrong? What did you do? That's a good question. Well, first... He stole the food money. And then he tried to hit me. Ooh. And then he spat on me. Elijah, is that true? I've heard enough. You're going straight to boarding school in the morning, young man. <laughs> oh my gosh. I think he's lost it. Truly. <laughs> that was good. Real good. And you almost got away with it. Except you didn't think about one thing. What are you talking about? Now you've met your match. You see? I am so sorry. I really didn't expect this. <clears throat> Kristen took my tablet, so I couldn't record anything that happened. But what she forgot to take was my watch. I was recording you the entire time. What? Elijah, it's not appropriate. It's not nice to record people without their permission, son. Yeah, maybe you're right. But it's a good thing I did. Because here, take a listen. Hope you're gonna tell them you had guys over and that you bought jokes with their money. <laughs> like they would believe anything you had to say. They already know you're a little liar. I'll just tell them you made the whole thing up and they'll ship you off to boarding school where you belong. You used our money to buy drugs? And you had boys come over to the house. Ooh, look at the time. It's getting late. Uh, <laughs> I should probably be going. Oh, and you know that whole thing about my fee? Consider it on the house. Don't even worry about it. Oh, no, no you're not you, going you, anywhere. You, you have when some things just to answer for it. Answer is. some questions. We got a complaint that someone would be carrying illegal substances on them. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, so I'm just... Look inside her purse. You'll find everything you need in there. No, uh... Is this? You're coming with me? Wait, what? No, I'm a good babysitter. No, you're not. Thank you, officer. Wow. I am so sorry about that, honey. I can't believe that girl was so deceiving. I'm so sorry we didn't believe you, son. It's okay. I understand. Now, can we please get something to eat? 
I'm starving. <laughs> of course, <laughs> you deserve it. <laughs> Anything you want. Welcome to the behind the scenes. I am so sorry that I'm gonna be so mean to you today. I'm not like that in real life. So good. Now what? you listen to me, which has me terrified. <laughs> He's completely nuts, and I think he wants. To <gasps>
<laughs> What's so funny? Uh, nothing. Nothing. You didn't happen to use my laundry detergent, did you? No. Why would you just assume that? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe because of the big bleach stains on the back of your sweater. What the heck? Uh. Mm. How did that happen? Ugh. My sweater was ruined. Oh, I see you ate one of my cinnamon buns. Yeah, you're right, I did. And it was a huge mistake because it tasted like toothpaste. Yes, exactly. Ugh. How did you? Ooh. Ooh. <gasps> mm. You all right? No. <clears throat> My stomach is acting up really bad. I must have eaten something bad. It wasn't what you ate. It's what you drank. No. No, it couldn't have been the OJ, because that's, that's brand new. Actually, I know it was. You see, mm. I knew you used my laundry detergent because I secretly put bleach in it. You did? Ah. Yep. Mm. And I knew the cinnamon bun tasted like toothpaste because well, that wasn't just frosting on top of them. You put toothpaste on the cinnamon buns? <laughs> Why would you do that? I don't know. To teach you a lesson, it's not nice to always use someone's stuff without contributing, you know? Mm. And then, especially, to lie to them about it. I think I need to use <clears throat> the restroom. Well, if you had just stayed away from my juice, like I asked, then you wouldn't have drank the laxative I put inside of it. <sighs> no, you didn't. Okay. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Some powerful stuff. Hey, Darman fam, I hope you loved that video. Please remember, we're not just telling stories, we're changing lives. And when you share my videos, you're helping to change lives too. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Hey, he's digging through your purse. Excuse me? Here's a pill, Grandma. Thank you, dear. I am so sorry. I thought, look, no, it's okay. I've done some terrible things, but I'm a much better man than I ever was then. So you're the third substitute we've had this week. No one's lasted more than a day with these kids. I've experienced my fair share of troublemakers. <laughs> I'll be fine. Okay. Good luck. I'm Miss J, and I'm your new substitute teacher. <laughs> Guaranteed you won't make it past lunch. <laughs> we'll see about that. Now, everyone take out your books and turn to page... <laughs> <laughs> Very funny, guys. <laughs> nice one, Jake. You got her so good. Just wait, this is just the beginning. Two times 10 to the six power equals, okay, who, <laughs> who did that? What's the matter? Is the person who threw this too scared to speak up? Okay, fine, I threw it.
So what? How would you like it if I did that to you, huh? You know, you should always treat people the way you want to be treated. <laughs> wow. I think she's trying to teach us something. <laughs> You're not even a real teacher. You're just a substitute. I don't know. Maybe I'll tell the principal I want to stay and become your permanent teacher. How would you like that? Yeah, right. You're gonna be begging to leave before the lunch bell rings. How's your coffee, by the way? <laughs> Very funny. Cut her again, bro. That was too good. Just wait until you see what I'm gonna do next. Well, looks like I made it past the lunch bell after all. You're definitely not gonna make it until the end of the day. Well, you made it longer than I thought you would. Mm -hmm. Yes. Those kids are so bad. Especially Jake. He's the worst. I don't know, guys. I really don't think they're that bad. <laughs> what? Hey, yo, watch this. You just have to tell him who- What? <laughs> oh, get out of here! All right, who did this? Jake, was it you? Me? Why would you assume it's me? I would never do something mean like this. Once I do find out who did this, that person's gonna be in big trouble. Unbelievable. <laughs> Looks like she didn't last long. <laughs> Miss J? Miss J? Look, don't worry about quitting. Everyone's been- Oh, this. no. <laughs> I'm not quitting. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> Told you guys she wouldn't be back. You were right. Hello, class. Oh, it's so good to see everyone again. <laughs> good morning, Jake. Surprised to see me? Uh, no. But I guarantee that you won't last until the end of the day. Thanks for your concern. But I'm not going anywhere. You see, oh, oh, oh my gosh, you've got blood. It's dripping down your chin. <gasps> Jake, did you, did you put a needle in my apple? Why would you do that? You took it too far. No, no, I, I didn't. I, I don't, I don't feel good. <gasps> Miss J, Miss J, are you all right? Someone get the principal. I'll go. Miss J, are you okay? I can't believe you've done this. You took it too far. N no, I didn't. Just kidding. Fake blood prank. I can't believe you guys fell for that. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't funny. You had me really worried. Oh, Jake. Oh, Jake. What's on your pants? What are you talking about? Oh. Oh. He pooped his pants. <laughs> what? No, I didn't. He got so worried, he crapped himself. <laughs> Stop it, it's not funny. Just kidding again, guys. It was just chocolate frosting. <laughs> I put it on your chair before class. <laughs> Everyone, stop laughing. I'm sorry, Jake. I had to give you a taste of your own medicine. Here, you can wipe with this. Uh, th thanks. Ah, <laughs> I got gotcha. That was so funny. She got him good. Don't poop yourself for real, Jake. <laughs> stop, stop it. It's not funny, okay? I don't understand. It was funny when you were playing pranks on me. Well, I realized that it's not very funny when you're the one getting made fun of. Exactly. So is there anything you want to say? I'm sorry. You were right. I should always treat people the way I want to be treated. I'm so proud of you, Jake. I guess it turns out I taught you something after all. But too bad, though. Today's my last day as your substitute. What? No, why? Please don't leave. But yeah, Miss J, we really want you as our teacher. Really? Wow, I'm shocked. <laughs> I don't know what to say other than, just kidding! <laughs>
I won't be your substitute anymore because I'm gonna be your permanent teacher! Yeah. <laughs> and by the way, your mom gave me an extra pair of pants for you to change into. <sighs> I talked to her beforehand to get her permission. Thanks, Miss J. You're the best. <laughs> Admit it, you're on drugs. Just keep an eye out for anyone who looks suspicious. I'll make sure we catch you. I've never took drugs in my life. You're going to the principal's office. We found out that your son is on drugs. What? They weren't mine. could come over to my house after school. Yeah. I'll have to ask my mom, but that's not good. <laughs> Frank! Is that you? That wasn't funny! <laughs> you should have seen the look on your guys' faces. <laughs> Please. I, I wasn't even that scared. <laughs> Blake! Gotcha! <laughs> oh, but that was too... Good, we should have recorded that. Oh, no. <laughs> Great, now there's two of you. Frank, haven't you learned that your actions will always find a way back to you? Yeah. I thought you quit doing pranks the last time you got caught. Uh, let's uh, call it more of a uh, short break. Look, okay? Halloween's coming up. We have to have a little bit of fun, right? <laughs> we can't wait to see you guys tomorrow. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go again. Hmm. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. What about them? Don't they know it's a prank? Yeah, it's okay. Looks like they're leaving. Uh, uh is that my cookie? Uh, I don't know. Is it? I can't believe this. You're eating my cookie. Look, it's just a cookie, man. Here, my bad. You, you get out the back. No! You've already been into it. I can't believe this! You're always eating my food! Blake... Calm down, all right? It, it's just the cookie, man. My bad. Don't tell me to calm down. I'm sick of you always taking my stuff. Hey, Blake, do not push Frank like that. I gotta teach him a lesson because he keeps- Don't you ever push me like that again? Frank, don't do that! You messed up big oh, time, did buddy. I, did I? I tried to be nice, but you left me with no choice. Okay, then bring it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it right now! Try to get the principal! In the world, no, try to stay calm and I'm gonna get some help. Okay. Nurse, what were you two thinking? <laughs> it's gonna be okay, all right, Frank. Just hang in there, help is on the way, okay? Hey, I, I'm so sorry, man. I you put a fork in my tongue. I can't believe you. Uh, you asked for it. <laughs> what are you talking about? He didn't ask for it. Yes, he did. After he ate the cookie, he said, Put the fork in me. I'm done. <laughs> we, we got, got you, thanks on Frank. <laughs> that is not funny. Yeah. You should have seen the look on all your faces. Woo. You almost gave me a heart attack. You know that? Wait, <laughs> what's going on? Let's just say Frank the prankster is back. Boy. <laughs> so this was all a... <sighs> I'm so sorry, Melinda. False alarm. Oh my god, we got it so good. And this next one's gonna be even better. <laughs> Are you ready? Yep. Let's get it. Did you hear about what Frank and Blake did in the lunchroom today? Yeah. I can't believe those guys. Hey guys. How's it going? Leave us alone. We're not gonna fall for one of your dumb scare pranks again. Oh, I know. That's why we're not after you. I 
Ashley, don't freak out, but there's a... Ah! No, wait, don't worry, it's not real! Ah! Hold on, just hold on, it's, it's not real. Oh my gosh, I freaked out, I thought it was... Ah! <laughs> oh my goodness, we got you! You should have seen the look on your face, it was oh Bryce! You guys goodness. are so lame! Seriously, grow up! <laughs> We're three for three. Three for three! <laughs> Dude, this is so much more fun with a partner in crime, hey, man. Just wait until tomorrow. Uh, absolutely. Uh, let's roll. <laughs> Later, suckers. <laughs> Later. Ashley, wait. <laughs> Don't tell me. Frank and Blake strike again. And this time, they got Ashley. <sighs> we really gotta teach those guys a lesson. Tomorrow's Halloween, they probably have something even bigger planned. We gotta stop them. Yeah, but how? I don't know, but there's gotta be a way. They're gonna give somebody a... That's it. What's it? I figured it out, we're gonna... I have to go. I'll explain later, but we're gonna get those guys back. Are you sure our plan's gonna work? I mean, who knows what they're gonna pull. I guess we're about to find out. Hello, class. We're gonna watch a movie today. Um, excuse me, Miss J, can I use the restroom? Sure, like. Oh, hey, Ashley. Watch out for snakes. <laughs> Very funny, Blake. All right, we've got five seconds left and we're down by two. All we need is a three-pointer. What should we do, Coach Brown? No signs of what they're doing yet. I'm be sure any second they're gonna... Use your hand, son. Hmm. That's odd. I don't know what happened. It won't turn back on. I don't know if it's... Ah! Ah! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Ah! Ah! That was really scary. Isn't that the girl that climbs out of the TV? I think so. I heard she's real. Yeah. I saw on TikTok there were these boys in Iowa that got murdered by her. Wait, are you serious? Okay, calm down. Let's not get carried away here. No, it's true. I saw it too. Supposedly, the last thing the boys saw was the girl's face. And then the lights went out. And... Ah! What is going on today? <sighs> Maybe the power went out. Or maybe it's a ghost. That is real funny, Frank. You wouldn't happen to know anything about this, would you? No, ma'am. Okay, well, there is no need for anyone to freak out until we can... What was that? Maybe the wind or something. That didn't sound like the wind to me. I think it's coming from that window over there. <sighs> See? I told you, there is nothing to worry about. There she is! <laughs> I'll go get the principal. No, 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 don't do that. Uh, Mrs. J? Is everything all right? It was uh, all just a joke. Can you please get up now? I don't feel her pulse. No, please. Miss J, Miss J. Please, please wake up. Okay, we were just kidding. An ambulance is already on its way. You guys won't believe it, but 
and she got hit by a car. What? No. No. You guys go check up on her, okay? We'll stay back with Mrs. J. Ashley, stay with us. Please stay with us. The ambulance is almost here. No, I'm so sorry. She came from out of nowhere. Ashley! Ashley, are you okay? Oh, no. Ashley, please talk to us. What happened? I didn't see her. She was running so fast. It was like she saw a ghost or something. Oh, no. Not Mrs. J, too. Barbara, please, say something. Barbara! Please, please, please wake up, Miss J. It looks like she's moving a little. I... We, we can hear you. What'd you say? Got you too. <laughs> <laughs> Means that this was all a prank. Uh huh. <laughs> Wait, what about the EMT workers and the driver? These are just our Halloween costumes. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe you guys fell for it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually Erica's aunt. When she told me she had this idea, I just couldn't say no. <laughs> that wasn't funny, guys. Yeah, you guys shouldn't mess around like that. Well, hopefully you guys have learned that your actions always have a way of coming back to you. And most importantly, don't ever prank a prankster. <laughs> 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 All right, let's go back and finish that movie, guys. <laughs> Welcome to Behind the Scenes. Ah! Have, you seen Have you seen it? Have you seen it? Blake! He's the third babysitter we've had this month. No one's lasted more than a day with these two. I'm not too worried. I'm pretty good with kids. I have a back. I'll be fine. <laughs> Can I give them a donut? Yeah, just make sure they don't eat more than one or they'll be bouncing off the walls. Also, don't let them watch any movies with clowns. They're terrified of them and they won't sleep at night. One donut max and no clowns. Got it. <laughs> you two have fun. Bye. 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 <laughs> So, what do you guys feel like doing? I've got donuts! Oh, I want one! Me too! <laughs> I'll go grab some plates. <laughs> wait, 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 look. <laughs> You know, it really isn't nice to keep secrets. Oh no, we were just talking about how excited we are to have you as our new babysitter. Oh, that's so sweet. Here you go. Thanks. <laughs> we turn the TV on? Our parents got us a lotto ticket. We want to know the winning numbers. Uh, sure. Coming up tonight, right after your local news, it's oh, I really tonight. hope we win. Apparently if you, you know, get the jackpot, you get like millions of dollars. <coughs> James, are you okay? <coughs> Is there chocolate on my nose because if so, he's allergic? <coughs> oh my god! What do we do? I don't know. You're the babysitter. <laughs> I'll call your mom. I, I. Wait, wait, wait! I think he's trying to say something. I, you what, James? I. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you should have saw your face. I thought you were gonna poop your pants! <laughs> you guys, that's not funny. I was just about to call the cops. <laughs> Ooh, who's that? My boyfriend. Oh, 
They're about to call the numbers. It's Lotto tonight, where you can go from zero to zillionaire. Ah, shoot, uh, Jasmine, don't we, don't we have that uh, that thing that we need to take care of? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. See if we win. Yeah, we'll uh, split the prize with you. Uh, sure. Tonight's first number, 31. 31, nice. For your second number, 60. 60, yes. All right, the third number is 43. 43, you guys, we're three for three. Tonight's fourth number, eight. What, eight? And the fifth number, 39. 39. Oh my God, you guys, we're five for five. Yeah, right. There's no way. No, I, I swear, I swear. Look, they're about to call the Powerball. Finally, tonight's Powerball is 17. <laughs> oh my god, you guys! We won! What are you talking about? We literally won! Look! 8, 39, 60, 31, 43, 17! <laughs> How is this possible? We really won? We really won! Oh, oh my god, we, we won! won. <laughs> we won! We won! We never have to work a day in our lives! We can just play video games for <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to babysit anymore. Uh, who, who are you calling? I'm calling your parents to let them know that I quit. Um, I don't think you should do that. Why? I just would have him $76 million. That, that would be true. If those were the numbers for tonight's lotto. No, what are you talking about? Look, here. What you were watching was a pre-recorded video, so that was last week's numbers. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, are you guys serious? <laughs> she was about to quit. No, 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 no. I don't think so. No more donuts for you two, especially after what you just did. Hey, do you put something in there? <laughs> My mouth is on fire. What's in it? Hot sauce! Ah, <laughs> Uh, maybe you should get some milk. Uh, it might help you cool it off. Oh, hold on. Look inside the mug. Ah! Yeah! Now that's on fire! <laughs> Now's our chance. Okay. She said we're driving her nuts? She's gonna pay for that. Okay, I thought it. What should I say? Say, I'm sorry, I cannot be with you anymore. Ooh, <laughs> too good. <laughs> oh, the truth is, you're not good looking enough for me. You're fat, and it's over. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, he's gonna be so confused. <laughs> okay, said, perfect. He's calling? Reject it. Okay. He's calling again. Put it on airplane mode. Ah, oh, good idea, good idea. Okay. <sighs> okay. She's gonna be so angry. <laughs> and probably never come back. <laughs> What's the next break? Ah, uh, I was thinking. You guys ruined my donut. <sighs> sure you don't want to finish the rest of it? <laughs> Maybe I should make you eat it instead. Why is my phone on airplane mode? Hello? I Wait, babe. So, slow down, what are you talking about? <laughs> I'm the one that's fat, huh? H Hello? Mark? Hello? What? <laughs> what did you two do? Did you message him from my phone? Maybe. <gasps> that's what you get for saying that we're driving you nuts. <laughs> oh, and you read through my personal conversations. <laughs> you guys texted him and broke up with him? <laughs> <laughs> Great. He just said he's blocking me. <sighs> you know what? The lottery ticket? Pretty funny. The donut? That was good too. Even the spiders. But this? This is way too far. <sighs> yeah, well, I guess you won't be back here anytime soon. <laughs> no, wait, wait. Four for four! <laughs> is that what this is to you guys? Some sort of game? People's feelings can get really hurt, you know? You should treat people the way you want to be treated. Aww. Okay, well anyways, <laughs> good luck in your boyfriend, Mac. <laughs> oh, don't forget, you still have your morning lotto ticket. I 
I can't believe those kids. <laughs> Thank you so much for your help tonight. Really appreciate it. Keep the change. And listen, if you don't want to come back, we totally understand. It certainly wouldn't be the first time it's happened to us. Oh, no, I'll be back. Actually, I can't wait to be back. Uh, great. So we'll see you next week? Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> see you soon, kids. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Have a good night. Oh, we will. Oh, kids, I'm back. Oh, you don't look too happy to see me. Oh, uh, did you hurt yourself? I, yeah, I think I might have pulled something in my back. Oh, no. Would you mind uh, helping me crack it? Yeah, sure. Uh, thanks. Okay, so do I like lift you up like like this or like uh, that? Uh, I think I need you to show me how to do it first. Well, you d okay? Turn around. All you do, you cross your arms like this. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. One, two. Ah! My back! Hurts! Oh, are you okay? No. I am so sorry. Oh. What do, you, what do you want me to do? What should I do? I need you to call the ambulance. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, and I need you to tell them that. Yeah. You got pranked. <laughs> Very funny. Wait, how did you even know that we were gonna? Wonder who that could be. Let's see. Hmm. That's odd. Just a. Big box out here, and no one's around. Huh. Uh, maybe you should uh, open it. I could do that, or I could pour this entire bottle of Wait, water no, 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 on do it. That, do Stop! That. Stop! <laughs> oh, Jasmine, what a surprise! You got me all soaked. That's what you get for trying to prank me. <laughs> How did you know that she was going to be in there? Lucky guess, I suppose. Come on, let's watch a movie. No thanks. Aw, oh, please. I'll give you a cookie. I'm fine over here. Oh, suit yourself. Mmm. Wow. Mmm. Is that white chocolate? Uh-huh. Here, have one. <laughs> ah, oh, that's disgusting. What did you put in that? Ah. I hope I didn't put too much baking soda in it. <laughs> Why would you do that? That's so gross. Want to play a game? Mm. Oh, yeah. Marshmallows. Let's play. Hold on. Watch this. <laughs> ah! You threw your little plant off. You guys aren't scared of clowns, are you? No, we're not scared of anything. Oh, well, good. Because I heard there's a scary clown that just escaped from a prison nearby. And the police still haven't found him. Are you being serious right now? Oh, yeah. And rumor has it, he was last seen in this Neighborhood. Now you're just messing with us. No, no, no. What do you feel like? Just go off? Okay, I know you guys are just trying to prank me again, aren't you? No, we swear. Ah! <laughs> All right, you go into that no, door. You get it, you get it. Fine, but I am not falling for any more of your pranks.
Surprise, surprise, nobody's here. I bet you guys got one of your- <laughs> Uh-huh, nice try. No, we're serious! <laughs> like, that's gonna work. It's got a knife! Uh-huh, like I'm gonna let some- <laughs> Oh my god, what are you doing? What did I? Call the police! But how the phone's out there! I can't believe he stabbed her like that. <laughs> I promise we'll do anything. We'll do anything. We, anything, I promise. We'll do anything. We'll do anything. We'll do anything. Anything. No, 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 That was so good. Dad? It was you the entire time? Not the whole time. Fake knife prank. And <laughs> fake blood. <laughs> you guys got to admit, I got you pretty good. <clears throat> we knew the entire time it was you. We were just pretending. Oh, OK. OK. <laughs> <laughs> Air horn prank. It's the last one, I promise. It wasn't even funny. Well, it wasn't funny when you were pranking all those babysitters that came to take care of you either. Yeah, we didn't want to scare you guys, but we needed to teach you a lesson. That's why when she called us to tell us the plan, we decided to go along with it. Wait, but how did you know that we were gonna pull all those pranks on you? Well, next time you guys want to prank someone, maybe don't leave 21 best ways to prank your babysitter open on your tablet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but seriously, I just hope you guys know. We not. know, we know. Always treat people the way you want to be treated. Mm -hmm. Well, I better get going. Thanks so much for coming. Yeah, we really appreciate it. Of course. I just hope you guys have better luck with the next babysitter. <laughs> Wait, does that mean you won't be coming back? Why? We really want you to be our new babysitter. Really? Yeah. Well, okay. <laughs> but on one condition. You guys have to eat one full baking soda cookie! <laughs> Come on, I know you love them. Get some. Yeah, you get like some. those, right? Yes. It's your turn. You gotta eat one now, get girly. Some, get some. Bake that Welcome to the Behind the Scenes. Warning. Ooh. Do not watch this video if you do not want to bust a gut laughing. <laughs> We're not just telling stories. We're changing lives. <laughs>
find him. Who? Hey, how's your stomach, by the way? Ken told me you might have diarrhea. Is that what he said? I'm gonna kill him. He put Nutella and Nesquik on my toilet seat as a prank. So you don't have diarrhea? Shoot! What in the world? Ken! We know this was you! I <laughs> got you, Brett! Oh my god! Is that why you asked me to pour you a bowl of cereal? It was so annoying. Yep, I put a hole in the bag and opened the box from the bottom. Too easy! None of this is funny, Ken! Yeah, I'm supposed to be on a meeting right now. Just grow up. Don't expect us to clean this up. What the heck? What did you do now? Why are all my clothes pink? Wait, that's crazy, pink? Did you have something to do with this? What? No, why would you accuse me of such a thing? You really think I'd put pink dye in the laundry detergent? <laughs> I got you, bro. Does it look like I'm laughing? I have nothing to wear, I have to go to work. Well, at least pink looks good on you. <laughs> she really gets on my nerves sometimes. Yeah, he takes things way too far. We need to get back at him. But how? He's always one step ahead of us. I'm sure we can think of something. I got it. What if we put hot sauce in his toothpaste? No. <laughs> After everything he's done to us, we gotta do something better than that. Yeah, you're right. I just wish that there was a way that we could give him a taste of his own medicine. Okay, look what I got. Ken's camera. And you guys won't believe what's in here. Hopefully some footage we can blackmail him with. Even better. Watch. What's up guys? You guys loved the prank video I posted yesterday, so I thought why not do it again, except this time even bigger. It's gonna be crazy. You guys ready? Let's go. Great. So tomorrow before anyone wakes up, I'm gonna put this on uh, Brett's car. He's gonna think his windshield's cracked. He's gonna be so pissed. Let's get it. What a jerk. At least I won't fall for it. And then I'm gonna take uh, Andy's car key and, uh, well, I actually, uh, I put a red sticker on my car keys because we always get them mixed up. But uh, I'm gonna take Andy's car key, tie him to these balloons, and let him float up to the tall ceiling up there. He won't be able to get them down. He's probably gonna be late for work again. It's gonna be hilarious, so let's go. Is he trying to get me fired? He clearly doesn't care about anyone but himself. I wonder what he's got planned for me. And then for Alexis, I got this fake iPhone 12 right here. Look how really it looks compared to mine. Um, but I'm gonna take this hammer, destroy the fake iPhone, and pretend it's Alexis's. And uh, I also have this pink case right here to make her really believe it's hers. She's going to freak out. Let's do it. He's a real piece of work. Good news is, we now know what his plan is. Yeah, and we'll just hide everything so we can't get to it. Actually, I've got a better idea. Alexis! Why are you yelling so early in the morning? Um, I need a favor. Can I borrow your phone real quick? For what? Okay, well, I saw this turn on TikTok and I want to test to see if it's legit. No way, I don't trust you. Okay, please, please, please. Okay, I promise nothing bad will happen to your phone. Fine. It's in my bathroom. You can go get it. Yes, thank you. I'll be right back. Your phone's dead. Hmm, battery must have died. I'll charge it later. Okay. All right, so I saw this thing. Wait, did someone just knock? No. I'm pretty sure I heard someone knock. Would you mind checking? Please. <sighs> There's no one there. Hold you. Okay. 
my bad. Um, anyways, I saw this TikTok trend that said that the iPhone 12 screen doesn't actually break and uh, I wanted to test it out. You're not hitting my phone with a hammer. Nothing's gonna happen, just watch. Okay, okay, first, a little tap. No, what? See, nothing happened. Then. What, no! You just broke my phone. That was not supposed to happen. Why? See, see, the thing is, I was uh, playing another prank on you. You should have seen the look on your face. Look, this is your phone. I swapped it out with a fake one when you checked the door. I gotcha. This doesn't look like a fake phone. Maybe you mix them up, Ken. No, I put the pink case on the fake one. That one doesn't even turn on. Are you sure? Yes. Let's try. This is yours. Wait, how? Oh no, I must have mixed them up. Great, now I have to get a new phone. Hey guys, I'm heading out. Has anyone seen my- Oh, you must be looking for your car keys. <laughs> so what's up, Andy? Uh, nothing. You're the one who called me over here. Well, you know, just seeing what you're up to. Are you feeling okay? You're acting a little strange. <sighs> Must I spell it out for you? If you're looking for your car keys, look up, genius. No, I was looking for my wallet. Wait, is that a car key? Yeah, and it's yours. <laughs> if you want to get it, you're gonna have to figure out how to get it down. But I've got my car key right here. <laughs> no, that's mine. See, there's there's a red sticker on the back. It's a, uh... where'd he go? I told you that one's mine. But, but where's, if I had to guess, I'd say it's up there with all your other balloons. What? No, how could- Oops, I totally forgot to mention that. I took the sticker off your car key yesterday and put it on mine. It must have fallen off in my pocket. Ah, there. What? How could you do that? How am I supposed to get my car keys down now? I guess you should have thought of that before you tried to prank him. What's that? Red? It sounded like it was coming from outside. Let's go check it out. Wait, 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 what about my car keys? Is everything all right? No, you guys are not gonna believe what happened. Oh my gosh, your, your windshield's cracked, that sucks. What? what? No, this is not what I'm worried about. Look, there, it's just a sticker. What the heck, you knew? Yeah, it's pretty obvious. Dang, I, I thought I'd get you. Wait, so then what were you yelling at? About? Your car, look. Oh my gosh! How did this happen? Gosh, uh, someone must have crashed into it while it was parked on the street? That's not possible, we would have heard it. Great, now my car is totaled. Whew, wow. I would feel bad, but I did say what goes around always comes around. Are you seriously trying to lecture me at a time like this? <laughs> I mean, it is pretty funny. <laughs> <laughs> How is this even remotely funny? Maybe because it's a prank! <laughs> gotcha! Your car is right over there, dude. Okay, th that's not funny at all. You guys took this way too far. We were just giving you a taste of your own medicine. Yeah, we found your camera yesterday and saw your whole plan to prank us today. Which is how I knew to switch your phone with the fake one. And how I knew to put the red sticker on my car key so you'd get them confused. And how I knew my windshield wasn't really cracked. <laughs> okay. I don't even know what to think at this point. So, my phone's not actually broken? Oh, no it is. Yeah, that's the price you have to pay for trying to prank us all the time. Yeah, have fun driving to replace your screen. That is, after you find a way of getting your key back. This is officially the worst day of my life. Hey, um, could you guys give me a ride? I, I can't use my phone at all, I need to get it fixed. Hmm, I don't know. What do you guys think? Mm. Nah. You can call an Uber. But I can't, it literally doesn't work. 
Okay, I'm sorry. I didn't realize what it was like being the one getting pranked. I promise I won't do it again. All right, we'll give you a ride, but under one condition. What? You have to keep this pink phone case on your phone for a month. Ugh, <sighs> fine. I guess that's what I deserve. Come on, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> hey, Darman fam. I hope you love that video. I'm gonna let my good friend Ben tell you what it's about. So I'm the kid in the video taking the pranks a little too <laughs> far and you know, one thing leads to another and it comes back and it bites me. So if you're doing pranks, <laughs> just know that you know, whatever go what goes around comes around. And has that happened to you in real life? It might've happened once or twice, <laughs> but the goal is to make sure you know, that doesn't happen, so. <laughs> well, I hope you guys love that video. Thank you so much for watching and please remember, we're not just telling stories, we're changing lives. <laughs> we'll see you in the next video. Peace. Welcome to behind the scenes. Oh, wow. Welcome to Dharma's too. You just broke What Ben does is he likes to play pranks on us, so we decide to give him a little bit of a taste of his own medicine. Carlos. <laughs>